boom now we are able to interact with the ui you can see and we are able to grab the things boom 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 so everyone welcome back on this to my channel guys i am ramkesh singh unity game developer youtuber and blogger so friend in this today tutorial we are going to learn that if you are starting a new project in the vr for xr means unity xr so how you can start basically after watching this i was really got amazed you can watch i will drop the link in description because there are so many new features coming in the xr and they have also launched the new templates so that's thing i am going to share with you so if you're new on the channel make sure to subscribe the channel and also you can support my work here and it really help me because we are not making that much money but it really inspire me if you get any sample means this is not free if you want to support me so you can just join or you can just get any source code for a minimal price so let's start the today video so basically according to this if you are going to start your project so you should start with the template because they have given a amazing template from where you can start so let's suppose you have this version unity 2020.3.20 f1 and in this version we are getting this but remember that whenever you are getting unity 6 stable version lts version so at that time you have to also install this one by using the same version if you are going to choose so from here you can choose so currently you have to go on the vr core so just click on vr core and there are so many stuff unity is launching so you have to always uh, stay connected with the unity so connect to unity cloud so you have to connect because there are so many features that is dependent on the unity cloud so you have to always start with this so just give vr sample unity xr so just create project in coming days in unity we are going to get lots of templates so you have to not worry that much because they are providing so many stuff you have to just explore those things you have to just uh, understand that what they have done and few stuff you can just do the copy paste so here we are in the unity and here you can see welcome to vr project template quick start guide and here are the few things like we will get the tutorial that how it will work here are the foreign stuff so just close it so it is just rendering and people are asking that why i am not showing my face so currently in india it is much more hotter weather and i don't have ac so due to this i just feel so much sweating so that's why i don't show the face because it's really not uh, good to show so currently we are just able to render and let me show you what we are getting so here you can see so just turn off this gizmo and here we are getting our player so here you can see and here is the, our player basically uh, this player you can just use anywhere in any project let's suppose let me explain here is the input manager like in last time we were getting the input manager if you are already developer of uh, unity xr if you are not so basically i am going to tell you that if you want to move or if you want to give any input to the canvas so you need uh, xr interaction toolkit so basically they have already downloaded xr interaction toolkit here you can see and everything if it is uh, here so you are able to use and in earlier it was able to just aid in that input action so currently it is working by default i don't know how but it is working i have tested this one and in input action manager you have to pass this so basically this contain all the input related to like ui or moving anything and here is the xr interaction manager like hover or starting selector files so basically it is a little different here is our xr origin uh, that is the uh, our rig that will help us to move here you can see xr origin and tracking origin it is not a specify we choose mostly floor or device depend on requirement so these are the characters and character controller these are the different thing for measuring the height so it is a new thing okay and for the movement they have totally separate this thing so here you can see on the xr rig here we are getting the camera offset and here is the main camera and here we are getting left controller and earlier it was inside the left controller 
here you can see left controller stabilized but it is currently separate and locomotion is totally separate here you can see this is the locomotion system it is a, a little similar but uh, totally different and here is the turn so basically for the turn they are using the old one like continuous turn provider continuous snap provider and here is the for movement so earlier it was continuous move provider but now it is dynamic move provider so on the basis of the input whatever we are getting it help us to just move our xr origin okay so main thing is this and after that whatever interactable like here you can see there are so many stuff is interactable you can interact with this you can interact with this or you can interact with uh, ui so this thing they have added here so you can explore much more about thing if you want me to explore it behalf of you so i will explain but uh, these are the things that that will help you to start with this and this so basically interactable slug like here you can see on any object they have added something to interact here is the spider collider xr knob how it will be click there so everything they have added so you have to just click on there and you have to understand that what they have used to interact so rigid body xr grab interactable so for the basic stuff what you need you need this prefab so you have to just copy this one and let's suppose you want to do in another scene your development so what you have to do my game and you have to just paste here so your player will be here if you are just turn off turn on so whenever you will click on the xr origin so here you are getting the player so what you can do you can just take a plane so let me take a plane and here we can see our player is on plane okay so basically you can use in your project if you want to run your build in your meta device so what you have to do you have to just go in here you have to convert android and then switch platform so just switch it so make sure you have to switch your platform after this you have to click on the build and then you have to get your apk that is vr test and just do the save and remember the location so just do save so here we got our apk so just open the side quest so just open side quest So here we are in unknown sources and here we can see we are sample unity XR. So just click here. Boom. Now we are able to interact with the UI you can see and we are able to grab the things. Boom, 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 boom. So it's really amazing. You can interact with any object. You can see we are able to rotate. So you can observe any object that how they are working, what they have done for them. Okay so that's it for today tutorial thanks for watching have a good day see you in next video bye bye take care